at 340 right here at Exchange at 79th Street, which would be the 7900 block of South Exchange. We've had a, a shooting. Seven people are wounded. Uh, two are criticals. Other are in serious condition. Uh, we are, have, are from running down video evidence, talking to witnesses, obviously waiting to be able to interview the, the victims of this shooting. We're asking the public, if you know anything about any uh, persons involved in this, please come forward and uh, give us that evidence so we can solve this case. Several people were standing out near the Little Caesars here uh, when uh, two cars drove by and uh, just uh, started talking with them. It shows on video and then uh, almost immediately began shooting at them. So we don't know whether it was a targeted or there was an altercation during the conversation. So we're running all of that down. As you know, uh, this is just the beginning of the investigation. As soon as we know more details, we'll certainly update you. And I'll take uh, just a few questions on topic. Were the seven all together or do we have any? They were all together. The seven, the question was, were the seven people who were wounded all together? Yes, and they're all adults, by the way. And yes, they were all together. Any other questions? So there was someone who was in the car who we can see on video gets into some kind of discussion with the group and then almost immediately um, uh, shot, shots were fired toward the group and seven people are wounded. So we don't know for sure whether this was a targeted one or there was some altercation from that conversation between occupants in the car and the seven people that were on the scene wounded. Uh, right now, one, maybe two vehicles. Uh, we're not sure uh, whether the other vehicle just fled because there was shooting or was involved at all. So we're uh, running all that down. But uh, the video is going to help us quite a bit. And, and any witnesses coming forward also is going to help us try to determine what was said, what there's an altercation, or whether it, it, it seems it was targeted. As far as suspect information, car description, how many suspects are we We're not ready to release that at this point, but we will be soon. We'll go through the video several times. It's kind of grainy. So it's difficult to determine, but as soon as we are able to determine, we'll give you color of the vehicle, make, model, license plate if we have it. But no arrests? Um, no, 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 it's too, so early, we don't have any arrests. No one in custody. Can yes? Just talk about the brazenness of this. I mean, it, it, this appears to be a shootout. I mean, there's several evidence markers on the ground, broad daylight, 3.30, multiple people inside, probably the nail salon. This, this is a big deal. It's always a big deal. One, one shooting is one too many. So we, we treat them all the same. Uh, what I would say about this one is whether it was a targeted shooting or an altercation, it's unacceptable. And we're going to be, put all of our efforts forward to solve this shooting and bring those to justice that were involved. So any help from the public, uh, whether you saw a car speeding off or you hear someone talking about being involved in this, please come forward with that information. I'll take one last question. Superintendent, did they shoot back? No, there, there was no exchange of gunfire. Uh, the street is called South Exchange, so yeah. it's a confusing. Oh, no. I just wanted, yeah, yeah. I, he said a shootout. No one yeah, yeah. No, no. It, it was, it was, yeah. It was uh, just a, a victim shot, not an exchange of gunfire. So just one shooter, or were there multiple? Shooters? We don't, we don't know how many shooters. We, we do know there was people shooting. We're not sure, but there was not, was not an exchange of gunfire. There was shooting toward the victims only that we can determine at this point. From the car, from the car. Clearly, a shooting came from the car. Yes. Uh, we don't have the age ranges yet. We'll release that as soon as we get a chance to talk to some of the victims in the hospital. They're being treated, of course, uh, but they're all adults uh, and, and they're all male. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. And we'll update you as soon as we get more information.